Hello, now I am going to show you how you can start and stop the SAP server. First open VMware, after that go to file, open and choose the SAP VMware file and open it. If it is already opened, you will find this option. Okay, and choose this option, power on this virtual machine. It will start the Windows Server operating system. It will take some time to boot up. Now, when you get this window, right click on this. Okay, right click on it. Choose send control or delete and enter the password. Close this window, open SAP management console, you can expand this SAP systems, right click on SAP systems, start, ok and enter the password. We have to wait until this NSP Okay, or whatever is the name on the server, it turns complete gain. Hello viewers, I am providing SAP IDS and SAP HANA installation services starting from 30 US dollars. You can contact me for setting up a SAP IDS server or your local area network or SAP IDS online server or remote access server. Okay. We can see that now this server is complete again. Now we can minimize this one or get it open. Get it be open and open SAP log on. Double click on this. Enter the client. Whatever client you have, enter the uh, username and password. Now we are inside, okay, and you can do the work, okay. To close it, you can either close it from here, log off, or you can close it from here. Close this one also. Open this SAP management console. Now in the same way, we have to right click and stop it, okay. We have to wait until this SAP server again completely turns gear okay we can see that now it is complete gear in color okay now close it from here okay close choose no every time choose no option and now we can shut down the server shut down choose any option from here